Hi and welcome to Grassy Waters and thanks for joining us for Reading with Wildlife. Today's book is Opossum Opposites. Our author is, R is Gina Galloy and it's illustrated by Alexandra Bobrick. And joining us is an opossum from Bush Wildlife Sanctuary. Opossum babies are called joeys. They grow big but are born so small. Each the size of a sweet pea, Mama's pouch has 13 in all. Newborn joeys, so soft and pink, are bald with their eyes shut tight. Growing opossums get very furry to their mama's great delight. Opossum fur may be light or dark, though most wear a coat of gray. With large black eyes and a long white face and a tail the color of clay. Opossums have long, smooth tails that grip by looping and curling around. Unique tails that help them climb up, up, up and keep them from tumbling down. The smallest joeys live in a pouch. Mama's love keeps them warm within. Her pouch was once empty, but now it's full. Let the piggyback rides begin. A mother's possum's pouch is like a furry little pocket in her belly. Opossums are nocturnal. You won't see them out at noon. They sleep all day while you're awake and then come out at night with the moon. Feeding her babies, mama's job, it takes hard work, you know, to satisfy her joey's hunger so they can all play and grow. Some people think opossums carry germs that make us sick. In fact, they keep us healthy because they love eating ticks. Opossums may look scary with fangs and jaws that open wide. They're really just afraid of you, so they freeze instead of hide. Opossums are gentle creatures. They defend themselves by showing their teeth and drooling, but they rarely bite. Opossums play dead in a pinch when they meet a frightening stranger. Drama gives them their best chance to stay alive through danger. When startled, opossums stop still, frozen stiff, afraid to run. They'll go once the danger passes. Being frightened is no fun. Snuggled deep in Mama's pouch, jo Joey's travel in safety. Cars will always be a danger, but Mama protects her babies bravely. When they see unfamiliar sights, opossums appear to hiss. Strangers are afraid of bites, but Mama gets a kiss. Dogs, cats, and fish make excellent pets, a best friend for every child. Opossums are cute, but please don't forget, they're much better off in the wild. So that's our story, Opossum Opposites. Let's talk to Mackenzie from Bush Wildlife Sanctuary. All right, I think Tiana enjoyed that story a lot. She learned a lot about herself. Now, Tiana is at Bush Wildlife Sanctuary because unfortunately, when she was a tiny little baby, a little Joey, she was orphaned. Um, her mama was hit by a car 
And when somebody saw that, they actually searched her pouch and brought her into us with all her siblings. So we were able to release all of her siblings, but Tiana decided that we were mom. And so just like the story said, mom gets a kiss, she gives people kisses. So she stays with us at the sanctuary, and that's always just a reminder. Whenever you see opossums around, leave them alone and definitely be careful when you're driving. <laughs> Thanks, Mackenzie, for joining us from Bush Wildlife Sanctuary. And thank you for joining us in another reading with wildlife story from Grassy Waters. <laughs>